Good afternoon, mamas. So I know I said a couple weeks ago after my last What's My Hospital Bag video for mothers, um, I was gonna post a What's My Hospital Bag for the baby, but it's been a couple weeks and I've honestly been exhausted and I completely forgot. So I'm here today, I'm 39 weeks and four days, and I have a little small um, book bag for her that I packed. I do have an actual diaper bag for her, but I don't wanna take that to the hospital to get it dirty. So um, that's a good thing to do um, if you don't want to you know pack a big bag and you really only need a few things for the baby since the hospital already gives you stuff so let's get right into it okay so this is the bag that I'm bringing to the hospital I ordered it off Amazon um, I'll put the link below in the description for this bag as well um, so first let's start off with her little essentials. I'm not sure if they're gonna give me brushes or not for her hair, but I went ahead and just packed it. Um, it comes with like a little baby brush. It's soft so you can brush the baby's hair. Um, I did order a thermometer for her, so I got that as well, even though I know the hospital has it, but that's gonna always stay in her diaper bag. Um, I, it comes with a comb as well. And then um, some Oh, a file <laughs> and um, a nail clipper so that all comes in this little bag so I just stick it down in there and then whenever I, so I'll take this everywhere with me I can just throw it in the new diaper bag so I'm bringing a lot of bows I'm gonna have an obsession with them I think they're so cute so I have this white one here that I'm gonna bring it's from Amazon as well and I have a pair of um, baby leggings they're gray and I brought um, I think three different um, onesies to go with it. So she has this one with cute elephants on it. And then she has a polka dot one. And she also has a long sleeve, which I think is adorable. I don't know if it's going to be cold or hot um, when I leave from the hospital. So I'm just bringing this one. I think it's so cute. So I chose the, these outfits for her while she's um, in the hospital. So that way she's not just wrapped up in a blanket. Um, and then I have, of course, her going home outfit in here. I'm also bringing this cute pink bow and that pink bow goes with this onesie I'm sorry not onesie um zip up Carters because I was told the button up are so much harder to work with it's easier to change them when they have the zip up so I brought that for her just in case and then for her going home outfit I have this brown bow and that goes with her cute little yellow outfit or onesie long sleeve shirt and that goes with these pants here I think this is so adorable if I do change my mind again I have the um, gray outfit that I chose in the beginning so she has a few options I am bringing some swaddles for her um, two of them I got these from Amazon as well. I get everything from Amazon because it's so convenient. I don't have to go anywhere. Um, I'm bringing two swaddles here. And then two different pairs of socks. They're just regular a gray and white pair. Now, again, I didn't pack a whole bunch because, again, the hospital provides, like, diapers, um, wipes, etc. But I was told actually by a friend that they have Love's diapers, and I'm not a fan of Love's diapers, so I think I'm going to actually end up putting a few um, Pampers in here and a thing of wipes just in case because I'm picky and I don't want her to have sensitive skin and something happen while I'm there. So the last place I'm going to dig into is the front of the book bag here, and I put in here pacifiers, the newborn pacifiers. I like um, the man brand. For some reason, I can't find any newborn pacifiers everything is zero to three months and if you see or pay attention when you're shopping for your babies the nipple size is completely different when it's zero to three months so I think that's kind of insane especially with babies of course newborn babies any newborn um, pacifiers the hospital that I'm going to is a private hospital and they actually don't provide um, pacifiers so this is why I'm bringing it and then her sister's mother actually ended up getting 
this gift for her, which is so sweet. And it is a bracelet with her name on it. So I'm going to put that. Um, this was the sweetest thing ever. So when she has some pictures taking it while we're in the hospital, um, I'm going to go ahead and put that bracelet on her. Um, the last thing I am going to bring is a pack that I got from Amazon as well of um, pacifier holders. So um, I'm not sure if she's going to even take a pacifier again, but I'm just bringing this stuff just in case. Um, but I think these are so cute, the beads. Um, and it's just a pacifier clip. I can hook it on to her shirt so that way she can have it um, on the way home. Um, I have actually a few of these, but if anybody has any... Um, advice on websites I can go to to get more of these because it seems like they don't sell a whole bunch um I would love to see so comment below again um so that is actually all um again I'm gonna put some diapers and wipes in there that are pampers again because the hospital only has loves I'll go ahead and put in the description below where I got this bag from and where her actual um diaper bag is from as well um, hopefully the next video is my labor and delivery video, so stay tuned. I'm gonna try and post more and edit more, so I have a laptop coming in, thank God. And I will have more content out for you guys. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys soon.